Today we're filming our January favorites for you guys. Um, we actually have some similar products, yes, so we're we just do. gonna jump right into it because we've been loving, I mean, not many of the same things, but we've been loving quite a few things yes. the same. So we're gonna let Tear start off. Okay, the first thing that I have been loving, you guys, is my Laura Mercier, Mercier, I think it's the air. Yeah. Laura Mercier um, translucent powder, and it looks like this. <laughs> and it looks like this yeah. um i think this is the perfect powder like sometimes you might sh like dark skin or brown skin girls might shy away from translucent powders mm -hmm. but these actually well this one in particular works really well you just have to make sure that you blend it yes like don't just cake it on there no mm -hmm. you have to blend it out because if you don't blend it out i had a bad experience with this and i was like oh my gosh i hate this thing but then i used it again and i was like okay it was fine but in pictures, if you don't blend it out, it's going to show up like ghostly all yeah. over your face. Mm -hmm. So I really, really, really love this powder. Like I got this in the, my Ipsy bag. So yes. when I run out, I'm going to definitely get the full size because this is like my ride or die powder. Yes. And definitely what Tear powder. said, powder. use a light hand mm -hmm. when you use this. You know, don't be too heavy with it because like yeah. she said, you can be a little ghostly looking a little ghostly mm -hmm. so what i do is i just dab a little bit and i just sweep it on my face it keeps my oils at bay mm -hmm. i use it for all over my face but you use it all over your face no i only use it like or where i put my um concealer so see it's like a multi-functional product yeah. wow it's like a multi-functional <laughs> product and you can't go wrong with laura mercier so no, that is one of the similar that we had yes. this month and we love it definitely thumbs up so another similar that we've been loving is the ruby kisses matte lipsticks which are actually newer to the collection yes. we have been well we both love matte lips but yes. and i really love this lipstick this one is called dark plum i'm wearing it right now <laughs> and originally when i got this this was actually given to me i didn't think i was gonna like it because dark colors i didn't think dark colors flatter me but now i'm kind of like venturing out mm -hmm. and i discovered that i really love it i think it just has to be the right dark color mm -hmm. because some of the ones that i tried on i didn't feel like they look right on me but i think as long as it's the right yeah dark color i will be happy with it so yeah um yes i have two like rihanna said just like her and the colors i have are purple affair that's this color. It's beautiful. Yeah, I think it's really pretty. This is like a true purple color. So, yeah. Like, I, let's you know how when you close the tops, they like, yeah. yeah. And the next one I have is Plum Wine. And this one's really pretty too. And these are very long lasting. <laughs> yes. You put them on, they're not going to bud. So, I really like these lipsticks for that reason. They're like $2.99. You get them at the beauty supply store. The same places that you would get like LA Colors, concealers, the, your beauty supply stores in your area, you can find these. So, yes, I like they're these. They're very inexpensive. Yeah, they are. <clears throat> so, my next favorite that I have is another thing that I got in my Ipsy bag. This is my Kaylin... Kaylin just mineral eye polish and I mainly use this to highlight my inner tear ducts and I just love the appearance of it It just makes me seem more bright and open. Look at that. Don't you see it? I highlighted my inner tear duct with it today <laughs> I just feel so bright when I use this and also it's kind of like the perfect I mean, I guess it has a hint of rose in it because mm -hmm. it's not a true champagne I looking at it and I realized mm -hmm. that but I just love what it does to my eyes. I love this so much. And it's literally the only thing that I use to highlight my inner tear duct now. And I know that some people don't think that that is like a big deal, but that is literally the only thing that I love doing when I put my makeup on. I do it just to highlight my inner tear duct. So this is like my favorite thing of life right now. Of so, life? Of life. Like, I'm so glad <laughs> if she put this in my bag because I don't know, I've been missing out big time. So I love this. And I think this is an eyeshadow, but I use it as an uh, inner tear duct highlighter. So, once again, this is my Kaylin Just Mineral Eye Polish. Okay. 
Um, my next favorite is going to be my MAC lipstick. And this is in the color Rebel. I have been loving this color, you guys. And I like pairing it with the color Night Moth Lip Liner by MAC. This color is so pretty to me. I just love wearing it. I think it's the perfect fall color. And it goes with any skin complexion. And I think it looks especially nice on the brown to deeper skin tones. Mm -hmm. And I just think that you need to go get you this lipstick because it's awesome. I love this lipstick so much. I think it complements very nicely. And it's the perfect fall color. So Yeah. And winter because we're in winter now too. I think that's fall. Yes. So I love this color. So we're going to stick with the things that complement our skin tones very well. I wanted to mention my Shea Moisture Blush. And this blush is called Koya Plum. And this is the only blush that I've been reaching for lately. I love this color so much. I don't know. It's like it gives you a subtle flush of color on your cheeks. I don't know if you can tell if I have it on right now. Mm -hmm. But I, I love this so much. Shea Moisture, I already mentioned that I'm obsessed with them. But mm -hmm. this blush is absolutely amazing. I got it from Target and it was $4.99. So if you wanted to pick yourself up some. They have more colors. Um, but I, I got only had gotten two. Which was Varcala Spice and Koya Plum. And I love this so much. So one skin, Koya Plum, $4.99, Target. Mm -hmm. Um, the next blush I have is from uh, MAC, and I put my MAC blushes in my Z palette because I'm not a big fan of blushes, so I thought it would be a good idea just to keep the two that I do wear in my Z palette. I got my Z palette on Amazon for $12, and I just have in here um, Breath of Plum and Raisin. I like these colors a lot. I think they're really pretty. I have a purpley color, which I have on today. You can't really see it but i have on this purpley pinky color blush on today and i have my becca highlighter and topaz which is legit go get you some <laughs> but yes and i usually pair it with one of these blushes so i love these blushes so much <sighs> yeah it fits what it fits that's why i wanted to grab it i wanted to see if so now tier can go get herself some shea moisture blushes mm -hmm. as well Sorry. The next thing that I wanted to mention was my Jessie Girl eyeliner. I mentioned in our Best of Beauty that I wasn't a big fan of eyeliners at first, but now I'm obsessed. And this eyeliner has become my holy grail. So whenever I run out, I'm going to go back and get me some more of this. It's very inexpensive, but it has the, I don't know about the formula on this thing because it's insane. Like, it's amazing. I'm going to mention that I do oil cleanse and when I'm rubbing the oils, like to take off my eye makeup, this stuff still be peeking through. It still be staying. It takes a little extra, you know, uh. effort to get this off. Mm. So I am obsessed with this. And it's a true black. It's true black. It doesn't like, like you mentioned with the um, elf one, it doesn't turn gray. Yeah. It stays black. Mm -hmm. So I think you should pick this up because this eyeliner is amazing. My next favorite is my Lorac Pro Palette. I feel so bad because I'm so late jumping on the Lorac Pro, excuse me, bandwagon. So this is what it looks like in case you've been living under a rock <laughs> and you don't know what it looks like. And this is what the palette looks like. Like I have been using the mess out of this palette. I have been rocking hard with mauve, light bronze. Oh, there you go. Mauve, light bronze, and this cream color in my highlight. And it's very, 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 very pigmented. So if you don't have this palette, I do think it's definitely worth the hype. And you do need to get this palette in your life. Because I think it's a pretty good, it's a very good palette in my opinion. And like I said, I just started using it. And it's not because it was a bad palette. It's just that I just have been using other palettes. Because mm -hmm. I'm not the type of person who's just going to jump. I can't use three different palettes at one time to do one eye look. Let's just say that. I either use the whole of one or none. <laughs> that is actually the opposite for me. Really? I can't use like four I different use palettes. I all of my palettes oh, with one eye, I can't with do it. One eye look. I love it. I just be going from palette to palette. But, um... The next thing that I wanted to mention, so I did mention in our last favorites video that I was obsessed with the Shea Moisture Primer, and mm -hmm. I'm, I'm still in love with it, but when I got home, I realized that this was sitting there looking all lonely, and I haven't given it a mention, but this is the Rimmel Stay Matte Primer, and it was the first primer that I absolutely well, it's the first primer that I bought and I was absolutely in love with. And I realized that I kind of made this my side chick. 
<laughs> and it was originally my main chick. Mm -hmm. And I was just like, I she have to get shit. back. I know I had, well, not necessarily. Which, I love this primer. And I remember all the reasons why I fell in love with it after using it. Because it keeps my face matte. Hence the name, Stay Matte Primer. And it was very inexp inexpensive. Because the Shea Moisture Primer is a bit too expensive to be using it for <laughs> my makeup. Let's be honest. I just want like one. $14. 14. Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, I love this primer. <laughs> well, you guys, my next favorite. I don't think I have any more makeup. Actually, I do have a makeup favorite. I thought I brought it down here, but I can't find it. It's my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in the color NW40. I was previously using the color um, NW45 and NC50, but those are extremely too dark for me because I have dark circles, and I like to try to... Um, I try to get the my whole like face to like match. So I've been having a hard time finding a concealer, and the NW40 is not a perfect match. If it, it just was a little bit something, then it would match me perfectly. But it it does the job. It matches, but I feel as though that maybe somewhere on this universe there's a perfect, perfect match for me. But the NW40 Pro Longwear Concealer is the best I have right now. So I have been rocking hard with my NW40 Concealer. I love it so much. I don't have it to show because I left it. I thought I brought it down here. Hopefully I didn't lose it. Yes. Okay. So I wanted to mention my e.l.f. blending brush. This is what I got from Target. It was a dollar. I picked up two, not realizing that I probably should have picked up more because they were only a dollar. But e.l.f. It's a dollar, but the quality of these brushes are amazing, and I you used it. You can throw them it. away. Whoa. <laughs> we ain't going to be throwing them away. I'm going to be using them until they break or something. Mm -hmm. But I used it to blend out my eyeshadow today. I just love it. I love the quality of, of these brushes, and I just feel like if I don't need to spend a lot of money on a brush, then I will not. Mm -hmm. And e.l.f. kind of lets me be able to stay in my price range while mm -hmm. getting good quality stuff. So I really love e.l.f. And this brush is amazing. I recommend you to get this. Yes, that's not I go to Target. I will be getting that and two Shea Moisture blushes. Yes. Yeah. Okay, we'll ask you later. Okay, so my next favorite is my Pink Sugar Perfume. You guys, it smells like candy. I would spray it again with Brianna's probably like, no. <laughs> Don't spray it again. It's pure candy. That's all it is. It's basically just candy. The undertone, the notes for this I saw were licorice and vanilla. Uh, I got this off of Perfume Mania and it was $20. I know it's $60 at Sephora. So, but yes, I am on a perfume high. I like perfume. I like smelling good. So, yes. Yes, I have that. So, the next thing that I wanted to mention was my e.l.f. Shimmering Facial Whip. And this is basically... Um, my substitute that I'm going to be using until I purchase a highlighter. But I absolutely love this because it gives my face a nice glow. And it kind of, I don't know if you can tell, but I highlighted the bridge of my nose. I can tell. And it's like, I don't even know how to describe what this thing is doing to my face. But mm. I love it. And it was only a dollar. And these things are the bomb. And a little goes a long way. Please don't <laughs> use too much of this. And... I'm definitely going to purchase another one. Even if I get another highlight, I'm going to purchase another one. Because I love this. It was a dollar. Okay, you guys. My next favorite is a miscellaneous favorite. And it is my headphones, you guys. I really love these headphones. Like, they're awesome. I got them at Target for $20. They were on sale. They were originally $40. And these are just like the Sony. Okay. They're the Sony headphones. <laughs> I can take them off. These are the Sony headphones. And they're white, so... There you go. They're Sony headphones. Yeah, they're comfortable. They're squishy. I do really want a pair of Beats. I want the pink Beats, but that's just fresh. Okay. That's really they're like hundred. They're two fifty or one fifty or something like that. I really want them. Brianna, graduation gift. I graduate. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I mean, if you ever wonder what I want, I want okay. the Beats headphones. I would love that in my memory bank, <laughs> but. My last favorite is, okay, so I've been, I made myself a homemade body butter using shea butter and all my oils that I have in my house. Mm -hmm. And I use it for my hair, my, well, I have, I have two different jars and I use one for my hair, not right now because I have braids in, but I made one for my hair and I made one for my body and my face. And I absolutely love it because when I get out of the shower, I just kind of like 
massage it into my skin and when I wake up in the morning my skin is so smooth and it's like I don't know I don't have eczema but my skin gets really dry in the winter time like extremely dry so this has been helping my skin tremendously so I definitely think that everyone should go out and invest in some good quality shea butter because it's a multi-use product so you don't have to just use it for one thing you can use it for anything that you really want to use it for so I definitely think that you guys should go get you some shea butter and if you want me to do a DIY how I um, mix my body butter I can do it Okay, our next favorites are music favorites, and we're gonna start with Brianna's first. Is that one and already? So yeah, we're gonna do Ed Sheeran, Thinking Out Loud, cause I love him. That's my boo. When your legs don't walk like they used to before, and I can't sweep you off of your feet, will your mouth still remember the taste of my love? Will your eyes still smile from your cheek? And darling, I will be loving you till we're 70. They ready. Let's go. Feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling my, feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling my, feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling my. Feeling myself, I'm feeling myself, I'm feeling I want some hood girls looking back at it and a good girl in my tech break. Got a black card and let's sex have it. You should know banks is a bad habit. I, I do that was it for our favorites guys nah. um we also wanted to mention we'll give you a little update status on our giveaway we're still planning to do the giveaway we just haven't found the right product that we would want to give away we wanted to give away something that was of quality we didn't want to kind of shorten you guys so we're still on the hunt so please don't don't um worry because we haven't Enjoy forgot about you guys we are just trying to Give you guys the best, you know, for your support. So, did you want to add anything for that? No, I didn't. <laughs> so, be on the lookout. We're not going to set a date on when we're going to do this because... We just wanted you to know that we didn't forget about yeah, you. Yeah, we just wanted you guys to know that we didn't forget about you guys. Nope. So, that is all for our video. We hope yeah. you guys enjoyed our favorites. We and comment down below some of you guys' beauty favorites. And what you guys recommend for us to try. Because we love trying new things. Thanks. So we hope you guys enjoy this video. We'll see you in our next one and bye. Baby, I got love for thee. So deep inside of me, I don't know what to say. Yeah, 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 yeah.